All right, Ranger update, Steve's wagon, a little bit more. Let's have a look. There's the old girl after a bit of a clean up. The paint hasn't come up too bad, like it's rough, but you know, it's tidied up all right. Carpet made the interior look great. She hasn't come up too bad. I don't reckon. That's Robin, the Sherwood Ranger. Beautiful. All right, so um, just getting ready to go to the old Chrysler day. And took the air cleaner off Sherwood for the, oh, sorry, Robin for the first time. And um, just scratched my head a bit and went, what the? <laughs> Have a crack at it, would you? Fair dinkum, there's no kick down hooked up. They've played it off the exhaust manifold. At the hot box and it looks like maybe shaved the bottom off the inlet manifold. So ground the bottom off the inlet manifold for clearance of the bolts and stuff. I don't know. But anyway, we've got a carburetor that's leaking fuel. Um, it was running like a hairy goat, but it was the reason I took the air cleaner off to have a look at what was going on. So what I think is going to happen, I've had to dig around and um, found what looks to be a half decent two barrel manifold. So. I haven't got a good carter, but I do have a 350 Holly sitting over there I think will work, so. I reckon that might be this afternoon's plan, is to bolt that on and, um, yeah, put a two barrel on him, get rid of all that junk and get a kick down hooked up and make everything work, so. Might have a go. That's what I might do, take all that off and put something decent on there. Anyway, I'll get into it. Okay, pulled a heap of bits out of the shed and she's running with a 350 holly and a two barrel instead. Beautiful. Put a couple of watches under the flat pole screw, flat level screw, but other than that. The big girl is purring. Much better than that single barrel cack and it might even go good. Oh, look at the switch she blew out of the pot. <laughs> Actually can breathe. Right, she's running good. Okay, we've done a little bit of this big girl. She's got a two barrel in the holly under there now. And um, things appears to be running all right. Not um seems to be running okay. I think our redneck um kick down linkage might be picking a little bit, but other than that. Um, Got rid of some wiring and crap that was here that didn't really need to be there. There was actually a VG fuse box screwed up here with a live wire running down to here where the starter relay was mounted. That was up here and yeah, there was all sorts of weirdness. The earth the line, the earth lead was actually in a head bolt and yeah, you know, just put it all back to the way it should be. And um and yeah, she's sitting there purring away. I might even drive her up a deal cross today on Sunday now the way she's sounding. Another fuel filter on her, it's all looking good there, nice and clean. Yep, job's right. Anyway, let's keep on looking. Alright, that's about it. I reckon she's ready to go. She's got an eyebrow, she's got some regal caps, she's got a two barrel. She's um, not going too bad. Replace the moulds and stuff. Put another boot mould on it where it had the big screws through it before. All done. Found a seal mould for her. It's on there now. Put the mould on top of the door. The eyebrow's the best. That's made it, I reckon. Right. I was gonna pull the bull bar off, but I think I might just drive it with the bull bar on it, so. We might take it to the York Chrysler Day on Sunday. We'll see what happens. Just moving cars around. It's 
Always fun. Hard top's done. That one now. Then the other hard top. A little scene is a cool thing. I like that car. Yeah, not too shabby at all. <laughs> okay, um, they're on the ground. Suck the on. Know he got the boat. Okay, Steve's big goon. She's been in here, got a new tailpipe and muffler fitted, um, spark plugs, leads, new water pump, and um, and yeah, now I get to take it for the 10k drive out to Steve's house so he can drop me home. You gotta love that. <laughs> Way we go. She's a 318 904 CL Regal wagon, factory air. Great old thing, 208,877 kilometres on the speedo as I sit here in it now. Great old car, topaz gold, sports rims, you know. It's a beautiful thing. We found, I was only looking at the dates this morning with Steve, but it was four years ago. Found it laying in a shed and um, went down and picked it up and Steve's loved her ever since. So, beautiful old wagon she is see what she's like now she had a bit of a mess in her when she come in so hopefully the plugs and leads have sorted that out and an exhaust leak in a few spots and still had the standard pipe on it so it was pretty quiet now she's got a um, two and a half inch muffler and tail pipe on it so she got a little bit of a noise to her again now actually here and now you couldn't before sweet okay that was a ranger update a bit on steve's wagon and uh, moving some stuff around the yard so that finished us up you know the drill if you haven't already please like subscribe share it around and um have a good one cheers it's amazing just doing his thing Not quite sure what his thing is, whether he's dropping a turd or just hanging out, but just doing all that stuff. There he goes. Here's enough over the road. See you, Wombles.